Hey, grand rising and bright blessings to all of my petal patrons. Welcome to Sunday. It is the 14th of September 2024. It makes it a five numerological energy value and frequency day and fives are all about embracing the changes that are going to be showing up for us and today is one of the most delicious days to get that done not only do we have the grand trine between these earth signs today all of the air signs are in perfect alignment as well so are gemini libras and aquarius and of course those positions are creating this kite formation again that comes in and even though we see the formation of a grand cross that's showing up again these guys these are unique energies and these are unique times and so pay attention to the significance of what some of these things look like so in general because of all of the trying energy we only have one square that's going to show up at like 10 o'clock and it's going to be void which means we're going to wake up into void square energy between Uranus and the moon in Aquarius. Everything else is positive. Well, there's one quincunx that's going to give you the energy of the entire day. So the quincunxes are the yellow lines that say we got to sit down and have this conversation, right? And that is going to be between the sun and Virgo, and it very specifically is what's going on here with the moon in Aquarius. It hasn't developed here in the map yet. It will show up about 4, 15, 7, 15, between both of the coast. But let's look at those independently. Sun and Virgo wants you to get things organized so that you can make the best possible decision for yourself, okay? The moon in Aquarius, as we talked about, wants you to be fiercely independent in the things that you can do for yourself. So the Mo and the Joe connect today to say you can do this. You just have to face the fact that there has to be some sort of a shift or a change because when you make that decision, all the heavens are opening themselves up today to assist you in getting that whole conversation done. It is absolutely brilliant. So let's go ahead and recognize that whatever it is that you've been stuck in your brain about, um, where you are trying to release yourself from a negative pattern or a negative person or a negative situation potentially, or something just ain't working right and you've got to you know, do something different. You've got to shake it up and you've got to do something different. Today the universe goes, yes! So, <laughs> And for many of you, if you do that, you're going to avoid a problem later on. We don't want the universe to come snatch things from us. Although sometimes some of us wait to the very last second. <laughs> but today the universe is saying today you can open yourself up in a different way. So let's break it down to each of the different zodiacs because there's power in each one of these today. Aries. Get your butt out there and do something new. The Chiron in Aries has its own independent sextile. The purple lines are a party. It's been rough for you. Today's the day to go and do something new and embrace the newness of whatever it is you're going to do. My Taurus friend. Now, with all of the trying energy that's been going on, you're going to need to integrate your energies just a little bit differently today. You're going to want to have an even balanced day of doing things, but also coming into rest. When you're in your rested state today, that is when things are going to really soak up for you and um, open up, I would say, more of your crown chakra activity so that you go, oh, this is the next thing I'm getting ready to do. Okay, so just make sure you're taking some time to rest in that energy, <clears throat> very specifically because you have the sextile with Papa Saturn, so he's going to want to make sure that you are approaching things logically. Gemini, listen, 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 Linda, listen, listen, listen. <laughs> you have to watch your checklist today. You have to watch your online accounts. Today is a day where if you can find out something that is in spend, in circulation, whether it's physical dollars, investments, even your energy, something that you're giving something back to you. Today is the day where you go, I'm going to stop a little bit of that activity over there. You're going to call your power back today and you're going to get back in balance. Whatever small change you make today, trust me, it is going to pay off huge for you. Cancer friends. Today is also the day where, because of this energy going on with the Cancer, but this is still perfect energy with Mercury, and with this mini energy that's popping up here within this Pluto and Capricorn, a baby grand cross for you. Remember, oppositions are those perfect opportunities to really get down to the brass tacks about something so that you can work through it. For you, what it's going to involve is being very, very truthful with someone or something regarding a subject that is just... It, we got to stop this whole process now. Stop the bleeding. Let's fix this now. That's the energy that you're going to be in. And if you are truthful, it's going to carry a lot of weight for people today. Same sort of conversation with Capricorn, but we'll get there in a minute. Uh, Leo, all of you fire signs have had to lay low these past couple days. Leo, come out today. Come out.
about to play, Theo, because whatever it is that you've heard over these past couple of days, that is exactly what you need to do or hear to start making these other adjustments. And your intuition is so heightened today. I'm telling you, just trust Virgo. You got literally everything going on in your sign today. You have squares, you have primes, you got the opposition, you got some quincunx is going on in there. One of the things that I can tell you is that whatever change you make today, especially with this Pluto Capricorn energy that's coming on, whatever you choose to change or shift today, whether it's personal, family, business, in any sector of your life, okay? When you sit down and you think about your cups overflowing, so to speak, today's the day we're going to do something that's going to make sure you get to that point. So just take it easy today, all right? Um, if my Libra camp will step up to the front, Libra Betty, okay? Listen, today is the day where all of this angst and this craziness that's been going on in your space today, whatever you thought was done, the universe said, oh, no, no, you're not done. You just need to do it a little bit differently. Right, just right a little here. And when you do that, when you get that spark of energy today, I'm telling you, you are going to know all of the steps, right? You're gonna, it's going to be very easy for you to give yourself a break. Get out of that analysis paralysis of other people's stuff and balance yourself out. So it's going to be great for you. Scorpio. Okay, my Scorpio friends, listen. <laughs> Whatever has been going on, potentially in communication over these past, let's just call it three weeks, especially what's been going on this week, it's done. So you get to know that you have moved past a situation that's just been very funky. The modern and the ancient rulers are both in positive opportunities today for you. So things are looking really, really good for you to just finally just say, cry two tears in a bucket and F it and roll out, okay? Today's a good day for you. Now, if you are a Sagittarius, so again, fire signs had to lay low. Today's the day where you can Say what you need to say and stand on your convictions today because you also heard something or involved with something potentially these past couple days that you had to just bite your tongue. A little bit more today, but you standing in your power today and making a shift with something that you also heard about is going to make you be the person, right? So carrying a lot of weight. And I'm going to say same similar for the Capricornius over here. More so of the energy that's going to come in for you though, Capricorns, it's going to have something to do with potentially financial investment um, and that can be in your savings it could be taking care of family kids it could, could be any of those things there's going to be this spark this aha this blessing thing that comes in it's just about you moving a few things here so it's just about shaking some things up and analyzing it in a different way maybe but also very powerful okay um, and then if you happen to be an Aquarius friend, then you are also kind of similar to what was going on with Scorpio in one sense. You are aware of the different thought process that, that you've had in actions. Because you go through and you analyze things a lot too. Okay, you do. But today is where you realize, ooh, the energy feels better here. And I would like to have more of that. So I'm going to spend more time there. And eh, I don't really love that. I like it, but I don't love it. So let's make sure that we're doing things that we love and if you focus more on the loves and you let go of the likes trust me woo, you guys are gonna go far today it is so sexy for you guys today and then that leaves us with our piscean friends that are out here my pisces friends listen today is gonna be the day where the universe <clears throat> wants to give you blessings in one sense here's what's gonna happen yes you have a little bit of a tiny square that's going on here with papa saturn okay when it comes to that jupiter specific position but the other thing that shows up in your favor is the fact that Pluto is having this positive conversation with Neptune about the way that things can shift for you and start to build and grow. So this is a positive day for our Pisces that are out there. So all of us have these gorgeous opportunities today to capitalize, make some minor modifications, and rock it out. Whatever it is that you do as far as your gratitude or your money appreciations or any of those things, get on that today with the quickness. And as always, may you receive everything that you need, everything that you want to desire, and continue to find the beauty in all things. Happy Sunday. Bye.